Thank you so much for joining for another video. This is our Living Things. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're new, thank you so much for joining me and welcome you to my channel. Today, my wife and I are having some homemade meals. We having what are we having, baby? Um, some it's like a what is it? A kale? Oh, a Mediterranean kale salad. You know, one of those package deals. It's not my sweet kale, but it's good. It, I wanted to try something different, yes. but I'll have some sweet kale coming yes. soon. Yes. We had to lighten it up. It's been pretty heavy lately. Yes. Okay, and so, and some grilled uh, boneless, skinless. Yes. Chicken. Chicken. Thighs. Chicken. Thighs. Leg meat. Yes. And, um... I stole one of her little wabitos right Wibitos, there. Wabitos, my boys. And my jalapenos and yes. a little drizzle of rice. Parmesan. Yeah. Oh, did I not bit. say rice? Yeah, and I have a little bit yeah, of rice in there. Yeah, have rice. And, you know, of course, I have for my eggs. You know, guys, what I have for my eggs? Yes. I got my hair red hot chili. Red hot sweet chili. I should get paid for all this commercial, but I don't care if I don't because I'm loving it and I love the sauce. Well, now that you mentioned it, okay, anybody who watches this knows that I have my chili oil in here. Chili oil. Jizzle and jalapenos right there. Yeah. So anyways. Okay, so if you don't mind, baby, because I've been waiting for a while. I'm mean, hungry. I've been making this a while ago, and now I'm hungry. Is it okay if we begin? Don't wait for me. Don't wait for you. I'm going to put my little red hot chili. Uh -huh. Sweet chili. I love this red hot chili. It's my favorite for my eggs. So I hope you guys are having a good day. We're having a great day. It's been really hot. Really hot here, but... I know we're in August, hopefully it's by September, October, sometime will get cool. And my love goes to the ones now that are going through Dorian. I'm hoping mm. people, in my, I know I have family in Miami, I'm going to have to hit them up to make sure Dorian just went through Puerto Rico. I think I missed it, but now it's about to get the Virgin Islands and it's supposed to get the um, Miami. It's supposed to hit Miami mm. and I have family in Miami. So I hope everybody... Georgia, everybody that's watching us, I'm hoping you guys are safe and please let us tell you to evacuate. Evacuate, please, when I stay there. And let's pray for people that's that are going tough. through that right now because that's that really is tough. I know we have earthquakes here in California, but I'm sorry, but those the hurricanes mm. really freaks the hell out of me. So, anyways, my prayers go for you guys. Mm -hmm. Please stay safe and they tell you to evacuate. Please evacuate. A lot of people don't end up losing their lives and losing their home or worse. So please do that, okay? So my prayers go for you, everybody in the United States well, that Dorian is hitting right now. Yeah. That's really scary. Yeah. And so just pray for them, guys, and hopefully everybody's safe. Mmm. This is so good. We made this in the pan. We put some spices. We put garlic salt, flowers, and pepper. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So let's try this Mediterranean salad. It's I not like my it. sweet kale, but let's try it anyway. Mm. I'm feeling adventurous. I guess I'll do this. Mm. That's just pretty good. It is good. It's um instead of that sweet puppy dressing that you like, um, mm. it has a balsamic vinaigrette. Mm -hmm. And of course, I got my ice water. This is really good. Really, really good. Mm. You know what? I feel adventurous. So I'm going to put some of this red hot sweet chili on my rice. And so I'm putting some, what's it called, panzu that we put all the time? Mm hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, I never knew about this chili. When did we find out about chili? About a month, two months ago? Mm -hmm. Stephanie and Tasha. Mm -hmm. Yes, like where have I been? Mm -hmm. Where's it been in my life? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? She's digging it. And you know what? It's coming back to you, zombie. I know you were thinking about me the other day with boiled eggs when you did your seafood <laughs> boil. Okay. <laughs> Here it is, zombie. You know I love my my eggs. Thank you so much for thinking of me. Thank you so much for the shout out. 
What's going on there? I'm, I'm, in, I'm joining in on a half an egg. <laughs> <laughs> Did you put some of the red hot chili? No, that one has um, Louisiana. Louisiana sauce! Yeah, and that. Made in New York City! That sweet spice is kind of cute, but I like it. Mm. I told you guys the other day, she has a stomach of iron. She can do the Baltino. I can't even do the two times spicy the other day. I was dying. Mm -hmm. What's uh, that? This is a water. It, it's a carbonated water. I don't like carbonated water. I don't know why. Cause I can drink soda, but for some reason I don't like when it's carbonated. And it's got like a little sweet taste, but to yeah, me it's like... No, it's not sweet. It's Which one's the one you gave me? Cherry other? lime. Oh. It's cherry lime. Yeah, this is the one. But it's not sweet. It has mm -hmm. essence. Mm -hmm. So she doesn't like it. She likes sweet. Okay. If you're going to give me some things, it's supposed to be cherry. Should be tasting sweet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. At least you get the mm. you get the cherry flavor. Mm. This is a bomb.com. You should try this with the rice. It's so good. Oh my god, it's the first time I tried okay. with the rice. Huh? Okay? Mm -hmm. Really good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have my last piece of egg. Mm. Again, I haven't had my first one yet. You can chicken and egg. Hmm? I'm having chicken and I'm having egg. Yeah, yeah she has a thing about that. No. <laughs> I'm having the whole family. <laughs> I'm sorry. Bad joke. <laughs> mm. It's good and bad at the same time. <laughs> well, which one came first? Mm, don't start. <laughs> you know what? You can go kind of nuts thinking, really mm -hmm. thinking. Which one came first? The only one I can tell you is which one's going to be last. <laughs> on my plate. <laughs> oh, again, good joke, but bad joke. <laughs> They were full of bad jokes, but it's all right, guys. Mm -hmm. Last night, late at night, I saw a video from Star. S T A R R. I forgot what's after. Anyways, I'm praying for her because she put it back. Um, she put a video. I told you, right? So anyway, so I'm sure you don't watch my videos or whatever, but at the comment on your page, mm. you do not have to say to somebody that's abusing you, okay? Because, mm -hmm. you know, unfortunately, when somebody abuses you, it gets worse and worse and worse and worse. It doesn't get better. So if anybody talks to Star, anybody watches her videos or her mukbang, please pray for her. And if you're close to her, well, at least she went to her cousin's house. Mm -hmm. But... I don't believe anybody should be saying what anybody's abusing because some my mind used to tell them all the time. And actually saying something is the beginning mm -hmm. of getting help. So that that's uh, on the positive and you gotta pray that she'll be And unfortunately somebody hit you once, that's the hardest time to hit you, right? That's fine. Unless you're both going crazy, but you know what I'm saying? No, of course. But a man should never be hitting with No, women. of course not. He broke his before V T V or phone, he broke everything. So anyways, if you guys do see her videos with Mukbang, please pray for her. And if you're close to her, she needs to get out. Okay. Somebody that was raised in a bad environment, you need to get out because it does not get better. It gets only worse. And unfortunately, you get used to the honeymoon. You get addicted to the honeymoon. They beat the crap out of you and tomorrow they, they make up to you. That's not life. Okay, so anyways, the reason I'm bringing this up because other people in this Mukbang that's watching tonight might be her friend or might be somebody who's close to her. Please pray for her and just tell her that she needs to get out. There's no coming back. 
I saw the videos last night. That's not acceptable in any on anybody. No. And I'm just gonna leave it at that. All right. So, how are you liking your food? Oh my God! You keep on getting these red jalapenos. I never seen red jalapenos. It's like the second red jalapeno mm -hmm. I seen the same batch. Um, that's cool. I like them, and when I see them, I like to get them. Isn't that pretty? I like them a lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can you put a little bit of juice for the time? Oh, yeah. Come on over, baby. Come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Here he is. There you go. Okay, okay, no better. You got the flavor. The flavor of the Pringle. I mean, this has come out pretty good. It was healthy. I needed some healthy food. Yeah. Mm. Mm. It came out really good. Hmm? Yes, it did. You did a great job with it. I did a great job, yeah! <laughs> mm, mm, mm. I also some chicken for our dog, so our dog has been kind of feeling sick. I know. I think you're right, though. The guy next door, I think he's spraying for rats or whatever. Well, last week I noticed that all of a sudden they, our big ones were, you know, really interested in that back fence and wanting to eat the grass and stuff. And I told her, I said, keep an eye on them because um, that looks weird. Mm -hmm. Sure enough, they like to sn sniff around and, you know, bite the grass around there. And now they're getting sick. Mm -hmm. I think they fumigated or something and, you know, it's kind of like... We're on a hill. It's a gradual hill, but you know it kind of comes down. That would be the part it kind of comes down. But she's really sick, and he's all sick. But my well, female... she was really sick yesterday. Today she looks. Um, you know she's been wagging her tail, and she comes, and she's playing, and you know she. But she's still hesitant with her appetite. She had a little bit of um, rice, rice and little chippy. Chicken. Little chicken and some broth, you mm -hmm. know, but I told her instead of giving them a big meal, let's just give them Split. a little bit at a time to test their appetite and build it up again. So she's been doing okay today. Yeah. But yeah, it's kind of, it, it does suck though because... She's always the strongest one that we have. You and know? it's been brutal. Yeah, so you know that's... I mean. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's been brutal. But uh, today, so today I made two different kind of chicken. We made one at a plancha, one at the... Uh, Sate, the chicken that I made was satay, whatever, in the pan. They were they were all the same. No, the one I made this morning was boiled. I boiled to make the oh, stock. Oh, yes, of course. Well, no, I mean, of course, their chicken is different than our chicken. <laughs> I didn't know that. Then I made we some rice. We were comparing the two. I made some rice for them. I didn't put anything on the rice. I used to put a little bit of oil, a little bit of salt. And I boiled some chicken, so that's her chicken. So I'm going to keep on feeding them the next couple of days. And that's what David always tells us. Look at her. Like she comes prepared here with the water and the wine. You want some cheese and crackers with that wine? I'm a thirsty gal. So that's why doctors always tell us. That's how we took them to the vet. The doctor always just gave them always when they get sick like that in the stomach. Especially with something like that. Give them some broth, some rice to coat the stomach, and some little piece of boiled chicken. Well, we've had a big pack. I mean, we have lots of experience mm -hmm. of sick doggies. Yeah. Old doggies. You know what I mean? That's where you start. Yeah. If that doesn't work, then you gotta go on to, you know, make an appointment. Mm -hmm. Just like a kid. So you have to answer our teeth for the first time. I got her, like, because of the um, I missed, missed um, sugar. She did a live with her, mm. and, and um, what was the other one? Loca, something. Anyway, her dog no, just passed away, so. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Well, it's the first video I watched, and it goes, damn. Oh. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's. But you know what the funny part was? And I do believe in this guy, because this happened. I heard my dogs, both of the dogs I had to put to sleep. I heard one barking the next morning. Mm -hmm. Everybody just seems to bark, and I knew it was him. It's funny because the next morning I wake up and I hear, first thing I think, first day I'm waking up, oh my dog, you know, and I hear, I think about Duke, and I can hear his bark distinctly. They almost went outside looking for him. And then Tigger, 
which is the one we had for the 60 23 year old that I can hear her in the bathroom the day after. Well, she said, not to believe it, that the morning of the night, she dreamt that the dog, her dog, came to the bed. And her dog was not allowed in the bed because her husband didn't like dogs in the bed. She wakes up, and her husband tells her that her dog passed away. So she feels that she came to say goodbye to her. And I have to believe in that. So anyways, Angela, you know, I comment on your page. I know you don't know who I am. I subscribe to her. Mm -hmm. mm. But also, let's give her love. Yeah. Angela Ortiz, oh. beautiful lady, beautiful lady. Oh, that's something, unfortunately, that, yeah. But you know what? She was not alone. She, I don't think she. Yeah, was. I know. I know. Yeah, oh, she, yeah. it just it really hurts my soul. Yeah. But give me lots of love, Angela Ortiz. You know we gone through that. We like I said, the last we've been together for thirteen years. We have at least ten animals. Mm -hmm. So this is the only thing I can tell you. Like I told push in your in your page. She had a beautiful home for four years. She had love from you guys more than other dogs do. Okay, that are yeah, in the family. Of so course. that's the only thing. The only thing that can make us feel better, I know, is knowing that we gave them a good love in life. So my love goes to Angela Ortiz, and I just became the subscriber. And she goes, "Oh my God! All these new people are in my page because she did a live." Oh. And oh my God, they're looking. Her hair was like, she goes, "My hair is a mess." Oh. I'm so sorry, you guys are watching. Look at me the first time. Oh, you know, me did. crying and freaking out. And oh. it was that's what got me close to her, and that's yeah. what I maybe oh, she didn't God. expect that kind of response. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, Ortiz, I, yeah, I no, saw and she's going through some stuff. Also, it's not oh, easy. Yeah. So my love goes out to her mm -hmm. again too. So how you doing there? It looks like you left a little piece of jalapeno and a little moisture on your salad there. She's talking about my little last bite. Yeah, I told you she likes so I see like a little bit of it. <laughs> like a little teensy weensy little mousey like burrito, the five pounders that'll go there and eat it. My five pounder little brat. So I'm doing this boiled chicken for my big dogs because they're the ones sick, not him. <laughs> and he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even hear me starting putting the chicken in the, in the water. He's like, <laughs> that dog will eat chicken and broth, man, no matter what. And he's got a little stub like this, but if you give him this much chicken and broth, he'll eat he it. Anytime he smells chicken in the he kitchen, thinks it's it. he thinks he owns any and all chicken. Like right now, he's following us around because we're having chicken. I go, hey, dude, you don't, you don't own all the chicken. Okay. A little five pounder. All right, we ate good and we ate healthy today. Yeah, I needed that. Yeah, I know I needed because I the last couple of times I've been eating very healthy, guys, and, and I, I usually don't do that, too. but. <laughs> I'm gonna have my shot, you know, afterwards, you know. I I'm mean, I'm in night. You know what? It's nine insane. times shorter. And I was thirsty. Yeah, she's always thirsty. But Ooh, my brain needed it today. <laughs> yeah. yeah, she had a hard day at work, so when she came out of work, it get free. I like it. Anyways, guys, so we had a good, healthy meal. I'm sorry about the downers, but I didn't want to address that. Um, um, I hope you guys are having a great day and on a great night. It was a pleasure spending again this time with you guys. Thank you so much for all the love I've been getting lately. You know, my subscribers, mm -hmm. thank you so much. I appreciate you all. And again, um, thank you so much for watching. Again, if you like our video, please give a thumbs up. And if you don't, give a thumbs down. Mm -hmm. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on the link below. And thank you so much for joining us. Until next time. Peace.